Are you talking about job? Is this, as I said before, for someone who has more knowledge, someone who's a sheikh or a scholar or someone who's memorized the Quran? Now you say, you know what? That that's that's for the big dogs, as they say. That's for the people who went to Medina, went to mm -hmm. Azhar, went to this school, right. Islamic Academy. Who is this job for? Unfortunately, that, that is the thought that you know the people, anyone with a beard over three inches, they give dawah. I just wait, <laughs> sit and watch. And but the the truth is, there are levels of dawah, right? There are different levels of dawah, and some levels you need to like for for example, giving a fatwa. You know, that's not my job, and it's not your job. The mufti gives fatwa. That's a very high level, right? Then there are certain things like you know teaching people in the masajid that would be like an imam or someone well versed enough to teach and explain aqidah or something like that. Then there's a very basic level of da'wah, very basic level of forbidden, forbidding anything that's evil and enjoining what's good. This basic level, anyone can do it. That's basic, anyone can do it. So on the basic level, it's an obligation upon every living Muslim. <laughs> so basically we're saying that, because look, some people argue, they say not everyone's obligated to give da'wah, mm -hmm. and they cite evidence from the Qur'an, yeah. right? Allah Azza wa says in the Qur'an, وَلْتَكُمْ مِنْكُمْ أُمَّةٌ يَدْعُونَ إِلَى اللَّهِ Let there arise out of you a group of people calling to Allah. Mm -hmm. You see? Yeah. This ayah clearly says, let a group of people call to Allah. So they say that we don't all have to give da'wah. Yeah. You know, if there's a group, if there's an organization in his Chicago that gives da'wah, then that takes the blame off of me. So uh, the scholars explain that a group here is talking about the, the specific things like the yani high levels of da'wah that only certain people could do. But then on low level, anyone, anyone. I'll give you a simple example that yeah, I always yeah, give. Yeah. Suppose there's a guy, very uneducated, doesn't know much about politics, history, Islam, aqidah, anything. He just prays five times a day. And let's say he has no skill besides making brooms. One day he'll make brooms, the next day he'll sell it in the market. That's yeah. it. Uh -huh. So no, no level of knowledge whatsoever. He makes brooms and he sells them the next day. Mm -hmm. Now you might ask me, okay, what kind of obligation, what kind of da'wah is obligatory upon this guy? Yeah. He's got no knowledge. There is some, you can always think of something he could do. He's walking to the market, he sees two kids cursing each other up. Can he tell them, Ya walad, boy, don't say that. Can he do that? Easy. Definitely. He, can he tell his children, don't lie? Yes. Can he, be, can he tell the person he's dealing with in the market that you know, I, I don't lie or can he give da'wah by saying things like, you know, I'm going to give you the honest price and in, when, I, when I deal with someone in business, I don't swear it by Allah's name. And can he give da'wah like that? Absolutely. So you cannot think of a scenario where anyone in the ummah cannot do any kind of enjoining what's good or forbidding what's evil. قُلْ هُوَ اللَّهُ أَحَدْ قُلْ هُوَ اللَّهُ أَحَدْ اللَّهُ الصَّمَدْ لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يكن له كفوا أحد. Say Allah is one. Yes. I mean, if you just know this, even that you don't even have it memorized the whole surah. Just call who Allah had. Say Allah is one. And so you're talking to people. You're delivering that your Lord is one Lord. That's it. And the Prophet said, convey about me even if it's just one yeah. verse. So that so does, are we saying everyone's obligated to give Jum'ah khutab and explain books? No. Yeah. But on a basic level, everyone's obligated to enjoin what's good and forbid what's evil, mm -hmm. which is da'wah. Yeah. You know, da'wah isn't just specific things. And I know a lot of people like to make da'wah, you know, just walking in the street, just handing out pamphlets. Yeah. But no. You know, Jum'ah khutbah is da'wah, teaching in the masjid is da'wah, you know, telling someone, don't do this, do that, enjoining good, forbidding evil, all that is da'wah. Okay. So anyone can do it. Now,